I'm going to go. Why did you say if God will go with me? But he said, if you go with me. Who you leaning on? Uh, who you depending on? Uh, what you going to do if your leaning post fall out from under you? If you go with me, then I'll go. But if you don't go, I am not going. Huh? Now, this is my saying. Lord, if you go with me, I'll go. But if God ain't with me, I can't do nothing. I, 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 I have a giving spirit. I was born with it. My daddy told me when I was nine years old, he couldn't stand me. Because I gave away everything I had. He called it kissing, you know what. Thank you. But I've been like that all my life. I'd rather see you happy than to be happy myself. I'd rather do without so that you can have. And when you're, when you're like this, you, you, you want to see other folks blessed. Uh, you, you, you want to see other folks have such as they have need of. And sometimes when you're like this, you find yourself being used. Uh, you find yourself being walked on. Uh, sometimes folks got more than you got, but they're sitting back on their little stuff and trying to use you up. But no matter how somebody else do you, they can't outdo God, do you? If you do good, I declare good will follow. Huh? If you go with me, I'll go. But if you will not go with me, I will not go. And she said, this was a woman of courage. I'll go out here in the heat of the battle with you. Huh? Everybody ain't gonna go in the heat of the battle with you. Huh? A lot of people believe when it get tough, the tough get going. And some people believe when it get thick, we need to thin out. Alright. Alright. One man said, I'll be with you. Right or wrong. But if you go to jail, I'm going home. <laughs> ain't going to jail with you. Uh, a lot of people, they won't, they won't go in the rough places with you. But this was a woman of courage. Laboring for the gospel. You are not to mind laboring. Huh? A lady, I went for a mammogram. And the receptionist said, she said, you know, I just feel for those people who had to work in the fields, picking that cotton and, and picking up those potatoes and pecans and stuff. I said, I'm one of them. She said, you did? I said, yes, ma'am. And I'm proud of it because I was raised up laboring. Huh? I was raised up laboring. Hard work don't bother me. Right. Having to labor don't bother me. I'll step on out there and I'll do it. Don't tell me I can't do it. You just challenge me to try. Right. Oh, thank you. The man was putting the lights in the church there at Revelation. And I said, I want him on a nine inch down rod. He said, lady, they don't make no nine inch down rod. He said, you can get a six inch. A 12 inch, a 18 inch, or a 36 inch. She said, You can't get no 9 inch. Down. I said, Don't hang not one light. I said, I'll be back. I took 18 inch down rods to the machine shop. I said, Sir, I want you to cut this in half and rebore this hole on the end of it. I came back with 9 inch. He said, Where did you get that from? Don't tell me I can't do it. Philippians 4 and 13 so I can do all things and through Christ. That's my 
son that next to the baby. Yeah. Baby's about three years under him. They were teenagers in high school. I went to work at six o'clock in the evening. Got off at six o'clock in the morning. I went home and changed clothes. And I got my two babies. And I come out of my sister-in-law house and got her two boys. And we went round to the church. And if you ever go to Revelation, all that ceiling back there in the, in the uh, kitchen area, the bathrooms, we put up all that sheet rock. Huh? We put up all that sheet rock. All that tile you see on the floor. The man came to finish it, to mud and take the sheet rock. He said, who? This she wrote, I said, me and my boys. I paid them and I took them to the McDonald's and got them hamburgers. And I bought the tie myself, the glue and everything else. I figured out my design. I put the tie down on the floor. The man came to wash the floor. He said, who did this? I said, I did. He said, I need to hire you. Tell me I can't do it. I put ceiling fans together. I put lights together. I, I, I put in lights switch, the, the, the switches on the wall. I put them in. Don't tell me I can't do it. Because there's a little thing that comes in every box and it's called instruction. Read the instruction. Put A with A and B with B. a shabby looking church. <laughs> and when they walked in, right. the first thing they did was look up. And when they looked up, they said, God is able. Yes. Oh, women, you can be courageous. Yes. Oh, you can be courageous. Yes. Don't let nobody tell you you can't live right. right. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. Huh? And don't say you too young to get saved. I was a teenager when I got filled with the Holy Ghost. I ain't never backslid. You ain't too young to get saved. 